Let's see. Hey, hey it's Big Andrew K here with uh with another episode of Thoughts from the Bench. I don't know why I did those sound effects. I, I have no idea. That was stupid. Anyway, I'm uh, using my bench a little bit as a workbench today. I'm, I'm building something here, repurposing a table for a uh, Christmas gift, and because uh, it is Christmas time. And since it is Christmas time, I uh, had to go to the post office the other day. And let me tell you, you want to find a way to take your gift, humor, singing, whatever it is, find a way to brighten somebody else's day. You can do that every single day. You can change the world and it give you more opportunities to share the gospel of Jesus Christ with people. And this is that season. So here I am trying to find a way to help people, okay? And I got to go to the post office. Probably the worst place to go right before Christmas. I go to the post office the other day and uh, there's some people who real irate, just irritable there, you know, and there's kids running around. It was the day when school let out, so all these kids are there and it's just crazy, all right? So, uh, so I'm there and I've got two boxes and seven envelopes, five, seven envelopes. Big, like the big manila envelopes that I have to mail out with uh, presents and gifts and stuff in them, I'm mailing them all over the country. And some people were irritable because their packages didn't come in or they had to wait in line too long to talk to somebody about something or whatever. It was just crazy. And uh, the woman, her name was Vicky, a woman running the desk where I was going to be, Vicky, she she seemed kind of irritated by the whole thing, you know, and she was just trying to do her job, just doing her job, just like everybody else does their job, okay? And it was my turn. I had been waiting in line probably 20 minutes. Uh, excuse me. Oof. Meatball sub. Oof. Anyway, I had been waiting in line about 20 minutes. Maybe 25. Holding these boxes, you know. And my arms are getting kind of tired holding these boxes and everything. And I get up to the counter. And I slammed them down on the counter. Just threw them right down. And I looked at them and went, <sighs> Okay. I've got to get this milled out before it thaws, this milled out before it wakes up, and these have got to get to their destination before they realize they're still alive. And she just burst laughing. Everybody in there, 40 people in there, just cracking up laughing, just dying. Oh, okay, okay. She looked at me, she said, okay, no, seriously. What's in these packages? Anything fragile, anything dangerous? I said, this one's got a live bat. This one's got some frozen dog turds. And these... All have scorpions of various poison levels. And she looked at me and she went, I said, don't worry. It's tradition. I'm from Chicago. That's what we do. And then she started laughing again. I had to tell her. I said, no, actually, I grew up in Ball Ground, Georgia. It's a little town northern here, you know, and, and 1,100 people. Well, 3,796, if you count all the dogs, the blue ticks, um, and if you count the trucks, you know, 12,000. So that's that's where we are. And she just cracked up. I <laughs> laughed the whole time. She said, what if they don't get there in time? I said, it's your fault. I'll tell them all that Vicky did it. And she said, my package is off. It was really a great experience. So uh, find a way to put some joy in people's life every day. And just so you know, that little bit back there, that's not what I bench. Okay. I, that's, that's, I, I don't even know why that's on there. Merry Christmas.